Series City, going south toward Parker finally. Um, I just drove around town and Pittsburgh Point and made a bunch of videos. Had lunch at um, In and Out and went to Walmart and bought the last Samsung tablet um, since my old one died. And I got lucky. So Verizon only sells, um, well, they only sell cell capable tablets. The cheapest one they had was like eight or nine hundred dollars in stock. Um, the Staples only sells Apple and and Fire tablets from Amazon. So I basically got the last Android tablet in town. I think Walmart did have some on tablets, but that's the Walmart brand. I don't feel comfortable getting that brand. Um, they are, you know, they run off of Android. They claim they're the same, but I've never heard of that brand. I guess I haven't looked at Walmart electronics for a while. I go, I go, where are they made? The lady, the lady didn't want to say they were made because she's like, they're made all over. They're probably made in China. I don't buy China stuff if I can help it. And the nice thing about Samsung is I'm pretty sure it's made in Korea. Um, or here even, some guy said that was in the store listening. But um, I'm just happy I got it set up. I sat in the Walmart parking lot. I will say one thing. This town is so busy that cell phone service is very slow. Um, where I was at the campsite last night, must have been using a different cell tower. It was screaming fast. And it's semi-cloudy, which is awesome. So I like this Ram ProMaster in front of me. The guy's got two um, big propane bottles. That thing's so little. I mean, he probably doesn't fill up but once a winter. You know, it's probably just for his hot water and his cooking and his heaters, all I'd imagine. I think those look nice, those vans. I want to see how much they cost. I'm, they're probably a lot, but they're cheaper than Mercedes, I bet. Ah, they have a Chevy dealer here. So I have um, 315 mile range. Shouldn't have to get diesel probably tomorrow sometime. Not sure how long I'm staying in Parker. I would like, or Parker, Quartzsite. I would like to stay two nights if I find a cool place. Do some video management. But yeah, this town has way too many stoplights. When I drove through the uh, residential areas, oh my gosh, there's a lot of traffic too. Ready to get out of it. So my tablet had been charging slow for the past month um, and then that's a sign that the battery's going bad I guess because all of a sudden last night I looked at the tablet it was dead plugged it in nothing tried to hard power it on and off nothing so I think the battery failed so I learned a lesson if any electronic device starts charging slow get a new one ASAP They got big old tires here. I like that place if you don't have a Les Schwab. Ah, that's a big one. Jeez. Oh, they have a Arizona tourist info, one mile. This, there are some pretty cool houses in this town. Um, I want to see how much the average, what the average price is. It's probably out of my budget. Like if we ever move out of Washington, I want it someplace cheaper. I don't want the same price or more. But um, we're gonna stay until my wife wants to move. 
Took me five, ten years. I just hope things get better in the city. Amazon is telling some of their workers not to go back to downtown Seattle. Too dangerous. You know when Amazon says that, they got a problem. That's not good publicity either. I hope Seattle learns from it. They're going to start losing businesses. They're all starting to go to Bellevue. It's just a matter of time if they don't clean up their act. Yeah, there's a lot of parking lots in this town if you're traveling through with an RV or trailer. Excuse me. Shouldn't be tired. I had a one of those coffee latte protein drinks this morning, and I had a diet um, Coke at uh, In and Out. Oh my God, In and Out is busy now. I'm glad I got my In and Out when I did. The hamburger was really good. Fries. I, I don't care for the fries. I every time I get it, I say that, and I still try them though. Maybe with ketchup they would have been better. I, I just, I was eating in the truck. I didn't want to mess. You know, I got my shirt dirty from the burger. It was messy. But London Bridge is on the right. We went over that in a previous video. It's kind of overrated, honestly. <laughs> I'm glad I did it though. I stopped and got some video of it too. Couldn't make it down to the path. I didn't want to. Yeah, I, I was out of my campsite at like 8, 8.15 this morning and it's 1 p.m. Took me four to five hours to do all this stuff. Wow, so there's a resort called London Bridge Resort. Oh, see, there's a McDonald's. I would have been happier. I do love McDonald's fries. Though. They have the best fries for sure. I just can't believe how many people are here. Like, this town is bustling. community center there it is packed there's a bunch of RVs in the parking lot too they must be using the showers or something I don't know oh this might be the last stoplight for a while In this video I'm not sure how I'm gonna do this um, that was pretty long but that was Lake Havasu City and I might put it with the previous video welcome back so we are just finally leaving Lake Havasu City I think um, and headed toward Parker Arizona and um, I really enjoyed driving around it today Pretty amazing town with the lake there and the mountains and the winters are beautiful here. Summers would be <laughs> really hot. But oh my god, there's some amazing houses right now I'm passing on the left. Jeez. I just can't get over the amount of money here. They've only had like five hundredths of an inch of rain for the entire year so far, which is only a month and a half, but still, the winter is when they get all their rain. Definitely need a swimming pool if you live here. And then I'd want it covered on top of that, so you're not baking in the sun. 
I just can't get over how spread out the town is. Not, looks like we're not quite out of town, but shoot. I think we're close enough. Just never know when it ends. shirt finally and then I get the in and out burger juice on it I was really disappointed I should have waited another day to change my shirt <laughs> wow we might have one more stoplight yet before we're out of town Let's see if I'm up. I'm just gonna try and type in Parker, but I started driving too quick. I really hope I can find a uh, good site by Quartzsite tonight. A little more privacy and cell phone service still. I don't know how fast it'll be with all the people, but. I don't really need cell phone service. Just some more privacy would be nice. Uh, some of the YouTubers that do this full time, and they do spend a lot of time finding their, these areas that are private and still have cell coverage. I'm starting to see why they don't give out where they are. Because um, it's it takes effort to do that. And then when you tell somebody on YouTube, all they have to do is show up. They don't even have to look for it. So I, I used to get kind of annoyed, but I think I understand now. Um, totally understand. But that's why I watch them, so. But they don't tell me I don't want to watch them. So it's kind of like a catch-22, like, you know, I watch it so I can find your spot. But if you don't tell me your spot, um, I'm just wasting my time watching you. Because it's not just for entertainment, it's to learn something. Um, I don't know. 